y'all what is up my name is patty for those of you who do not know and welcome to another weekly vlog y'all it's been a minute since we've done like a full like wham to bam beginning to the end of vlog um you're probably wondering where i am right now because this ain't my bed <laughs> So I am actually in DC. I flew in a couple hours ago. I have a um, a work event tomorrow, like all day, like a full day. Plus we have like a after work event. So they flew me up. <laughs> Go ahead, do it. Put me on the plane. So so I am staying at the hotel um, Hilton in Crystal City. Um, if you're coming to the D.C. area and you got plans in D.C., I highly, highly, highly recommend staying in Crystal City, super close to D.C.A. Airport, um, super close to D.C.A. Airport, and also it's a reasonable distance to D.C., like, it's like Alexandria, Arlington, boom, D.C., so you can Uber where you gotta go, keep in mind surge prices at night after, after you know, them club hours but it'll save you some coins okay because the hotels in dc are more expensive also if you're trying to go to that korean day spa at alexandria it's like where you right in the middle of all the happenings so yeah um i got here this is definitely an, an older hilton has been around the block a few times um so i don't even think a tour is necessary like it's just the king bed a little desk Little chair. The shower is nice though. I ain't gonna hold you. That's probably one of the biggest showers I've been in in a hotel. But I think this is because this is a handicap accessible room, probably because uh, it had like the bars and the shower. Um, when I saw a shower head, I was like, "Come on, y'all! This is supposed to be an experience." But the pressure did everything it needed to do. So, um, I was a little annoyed because I door dashed some food. Um, <laughs> shout out to be able to expense it. And uh, they told the door dasher not to come up. And this isn't one, like when I say this is an older model, this isn't one of those hotels where you have to have like the room key to go up and down the elevator. So I'm like, I don't really understand why they had to stay at the front desk, um, drop it at the front desk. And then the front desk didn't even call me. I had to hit the dasher up like Abra, hey, like what's Gucci. So that kind of annoyed me that I had to put on some pants and go and get my food. But he then, you know, that's that's it is what it is. So right now I just finished up um, editing the my first full like budget vlog. I'm about to do the thumbnail so I can have that uploaded. And y'all, I can I say I came in here and I was on a mission. Um, my homegirl was going to come and we were going to have like a little staycation type of vibe, but she no longer can make it. But I came in here, I laid out all my stuff for tomorrow, so everything is organized. I didn't iron, oh, I still need to iron my shirt though for tomorrow, but I did hang it up in the pants. I just showered, like it is, it's 6.46 p.m. I was outside a lot last week, so I am a little tired. So I'm about to finish editing this vlog, cut me on some movies, and call it a night. And I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Tomorrow, um, <laughs> my like inner team, my core team, we decided to go with the Barbie theme. So my outfit I'm wearing to work tomorrow, y'all. Wait till you see it. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. So it is Tuesday. I'm getting dressed. I'm gonna show y'all my Barbie outfit for work for today. Um, but I can 100% confirm that I will not be staying at this Hilton ever again <laughs> under any circumstances. Because can y'all hear that? Like I have the TV on, but do you hear that? So I know they're doing construction and they're putting like a new restaurant. But why would you not move your guests to the opposite side of the hotel, bro? Like. If I was here on like a date, getaway, and or you know just trying to relax, and I got woken up at seven o'clock in the morning for construction sounds, I would be pissed. Not only that, y'all, they have these little baby trash cans that you can't actually put anything in. So I got Chipotle last night, like y'all know, y'all. There are ants all over. Yeah, I won't be staying here again. No, 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 no. Um, 
luckily that's all that's the only place i see them but i say y'all they are all over this bowl they are all over the bowl that's sitting on top of the trash can because it cannot fit inside the trash can anyway i want y'all to see my barbie fit okay y'all so i found these sparkly pants <laughs> on amazon and i plan to send these back you know what i'm saying after but um they're just some really comfortable sparkly pants and i found this pink shirt on amazon i wear my pink bag we are barbie down my laptop to go into my little briefcase but that's the fit i'll show y'all what it looks like when i put it on hey y'all so i am back home it is like seven 741 it's been a really really good day y'all this is my first time like back in person since covid um actually no i had i did have an on-site with my last role but it's only one time so really and um it was fantastic like we had such an amazing day we achieved our goals it was amazing we went to a bolero after um and I know I told you at the start of the day I was really, really frustrated with my visit and my stay here. I was telling Marissa, and she said, uh-uh, friend, call them. So <laughs> I got in the car this morning, tried to call them. No one picked up. So she was like, call on the way home um, so everything can be straight when you get there. And the first person I talked to, I was telling them about the issues I was having. Oh, because the toilet also overflowed on my way, getting ready to head out, like was running over the toilet, like it overflowed. Uh, he said, well, usually housekeeping comes in, so why don't you check? Why don't you check when you get here and then give us a call? Sweetheart, this is this is hospitality. Like, this this ain't my, my home. Like, I'm calling you about. So um, I hung up, and I was like, you know what? I said, everybody got a boss. You know, Marissa was, Marissa was on my neck. She said, uh, call back. <laughs> Let's talk to the manager manager told her what happened she said go check what he said go check what no no we're gonna upgrade your room so now i'm on the 12th floor i have this beautiful view of the sunset this is a brand new um what you call it refurbished not refurbished when they update the room like this is worth sharing you know so i'll show you a little bit because it looks completely different than the other room it's like am i in the same place but yeah, beautiful, beautiful view of Arlington neighborhood. Um, and I'm about to show y'all this room, this shower. Oh, and I'll show you a full body, what I look like, hold on. So first of all, this is brand new carpet. This is not what the other carpet looked like at all. Um, you can tell that the furniture in here is new as well. Like this isn't, you know, five star, but it's way better than what it was way 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 better than what it was oh here's a mirror you can see my fit so these are the sparkly sparkly pants i had on today um i took the top in y'all this whole fit is from amazon this is my barbie fit today for work and i'm kind of obsessed i was on the back but i'm like i could wear this to another work event with different pants skirts winter like i could i could do some with it as well as these pants so it's finna stay <laughs> um yeah this is the rest of the room actually has some art on the wall i could tell they tried okay they're getting there and guess what's also here a full body mirror that was missing from the other room. An entire full body mirror. Yes. And I haven't gone in the bathroom yet. Um, this bathroom is definitely smaller than the other bathroom, but the mirror. Okay, because I could not do my full face I wanted to do because the other one didn't have good lighting. I was like, how am I supposed to see? How am I supposed to see with a little nightlight in the bathroom? Huh. <sighs> so I know they're working on it. And I appreciate uh, the manager, Ajwa. I believe that's pronouncing her name correctly. Super sweet. Fix the problem straight away. So I'm about to shower. I'm a happy girl if you can't tell. Happy girl. <laughs> Better now. 
So yeah, uh, the mirror isn't the cleanest. Um, they do have the people out. I saw them working, probably cleaning all the windows. But um, I'll give you a brief look out the window. Sun is going down behind the clouds, but you can see what I mean by the, the streets. But they did have the window people out. They're, they're on the other side of the building. So yeah, I'm ready to shower, put on some movies, kick my feet up, and, and, and the gym is right across the hall. It's only like a, a little short walk down. So I'm going to get up in the morning and bust down the gym um, before I shower and get on the plane. Hey y'all, I've made it back home. Um, so thankful for safe travels. Thankful no flight delays. <laughs> thankful for no lost luggage. And y'all, it was so crazy. Like if you saw that clip of like the clouds, that was literally right before we descended to Charlotte. And it's raining here. It's so crazy, right? How the clouds can be look, you know, when you're up there versus coming down. So it's raining and it is it is feeling, you know, my vibe. Like that's how I feel. I was really trying to decide. Um, unfortunately, mm, unfortunately, I still have to work today. <laughs> I have like meetings from one to to five <laughs> today, but it's fine. Um, I'm trying to decide what I'm going to do this weekend. I was invited to two events on Saturday, but I think I'm just going to chill. Um, I really want to go um, into my birthday month feeling really rested, really healthy, really fit, um, mentally, physically, and emotionally. And as much as I want to be outside this weekend, I really should rest because my sister's coming into town, I think Monday or Tuesday, um, because we're going to see um, Snoop Dogg in concert and then the next day is the Beyonce concert. <laughs> so this weekend, I kind of want to knock out some more sit down videos. I low key want to go to the Home Goods. We don't need to go to Home Goods, but I want to. Um, and. I want to work on some YouTube stuff. Like I told y'all, I'm really trying to be on my stuff. I'm really, really trying. So, yeah. Now we need to unpack. What's up, y'all? It is Saturday. Happy Saturday! <laughs> and um, I have not done nothing that I was supposed to do. Okay, it's about. Oh, child, the bond was halfway off anyway. It's about noon, 12, 12, 17, and I ain't did nothing. I have not washed my hind pots, mind your business. I was supposed to get up, start laundry, start a list, all this stuff. I'm supposed to be productive. I did do one thing, and then I did start laundry, all to realize I'm out of detergent. I don't got like this one. It's like, God, you just don't want me to do nothing today. Ew, you just want me to sleep? Because now I'm ready for a nap. <laughs> and realizing that I did not take any of my vitamins and stuff, I just you know you know like when you're tired and you start becoming a little delusional, like you just start being extra silly, goofy, and that's that's my life today. So I think what I'm about to do is write my lesson and take a nap. <laughs> Right to listen, take a nap. I did um, pull the sheets off my bed. And I want to show y'all why you should invest in a really, really good um, mattress pad protector thing. Because I'm going to show you what my mattress looks like. Um, and yeah, tomorrow we are going to go outside just a little bit. Like, I'm going to go to church and then I need to chop off Amazon return. I want to go at Home Goods because I want some art. Do I need to go on home goods? I don't. I don't. I do not. But we're gonna go anyway. Um, and yeah, yeah. Y'all, I have so much stuff that like, it's so much stuff I need to be doing. <laughs> Truth is, I'm tired. 
I was up till like four in the morning editing a video that I could have edited today because we ain't going anywhere. Like the math just ain't be mad. Like it's just petty. What is going on? Like I feel real like ADD. Anyway, flowers are dead. They're dead. <laughs> And they're dead because one, I left my home in darkness, and two, I forgot to change the water prior to leaving. So those are dead. These are real dead. Dead, dead, dead. So, um, y'all, it's just I got a piece of glass that's been sitting here since I moved that I need to put on the Facebook market. I have this box from this office chair that y'all saw me put up like two weeks ago that's still sitting here. I need to be cleaning these bathrooms and all I want to do is lay on the couch, binge watch some TV. That's all I want to do, that's all I want to do, that's all I want to do today. That's all I want to do, that's all I want to do, that's all I want to do today. And I say, hey, what a wonderful... Okay. And I got, I got dishes in the sink, like... You know what? Write the list and then it's nap time and then we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna run it back. Excuse the junk, y'all know about to be cleaning, but look at my mattress, y'all. Like Shoddy still looks a brand freaking new. Like, if you do not have a thick quality mattress pad, get one. I've had this mattress since 20 when I moved to the DC area. 2015? Grad day. Mm, y'all I had this much as a long time um <laughs> but she still looks so good and beautiful I am about to um flip it a little later like rotate it because I have a habit of sleeping on one side of my bed like I got a man <laughs> and there ain't nobody in the bed but me but um yeah so shout out to that mattress pad because she done kept a girl clean and also, um, my mattress is still good, y'all. I brought a really, really firm, firm mattress because I like a firmer mattress and I also wanted it to last. Um, yeah. So I brought a firmer mattress because I wanted it to last and it has really, really lasted. I got this mattress from Ashley Furniture. That's crazy. It's been almost 10 years. It's 2023. Bruh, it's been, what, seven years? Seven, eight years? That's crazy. That's insane. Like, should I just... I'm not about to buy one because I don't need one. And she is still very, very firm. Like, I like how the softer ones feel, but they just not going to last that long. They're just not. Um, and also, I really like the compression. Like, I wake up feeling really slender. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but... Get you a good mattress pad. So since we last spoke, um, I still I have not been to sleep yet. Like I haven't taken a nap. Um, I did do a couple things, and I was feeling super productive until I wrote down this list of things that I need to do. And um, the stress is back. The stress is back. The stress is back. <laughs> oh my god, y'all! So I think I showed with y'all like a long time ago that I really like to use the um, Microsoft to do on my computer um, I like you can make cute little to-do lists change the backgrounds and stuff and I'm gonna just quickly give you all a little overview of what your girl got going on okay hopefully you can see this very clearly but on this left hand side I have like to-do list for work but then I have my to-do list right and underneath here I have it broken down into four different sections right event items is I'm currently finalizing plans for like my birthday I'm a part of two weddings so I got things to do there then I have my personal list like I need to make some doctor's appointments errands I need to run things like that car I have cleaning things I need to get done to my home I'm um, especially before my sister comes and then I have like YouTube content planning uh, which I did knock off a few things today so I'm proud about that but like y'all Look at, look at all these things I really should be doing. So now, we got the list out, right? And um, we're about to take a nap. Just like, maybe not even nap. Maybe I just want to lay here and just look at TV and stop trying to multitask. Because it's clearly not working um, in my favor. And then, we're going to do a little cleaning montage.
told you I had a little kick of energy and I am feeling productive. As y'all saw, I got the sheets on the bed. I put those lights down, put stuff away, my suitcases away. Um, I started to spray the bathroom down so it's like sitting for a second. Cleaned up the kitchen. And I'm going to show y'all the reason why I be doing Target pickup orders because when I go into Target, I always buy something I don't need. And this is what I brought the last time for Target. You know what these are? These are the cute ice <laughs> potatoes. It also got like the, the really cute honeycomb ones. Y'all, I did not need this. Granted, these were only $3 each. I was thinking about like the fall and winter. Um, so I'm gonna be hosting a lot, cooking for people, you know, or whatever. And I was like, how cute when I'm making people cocktails to have a whole little stash of some really, really cute ice. But it was something I didn't need. <laughs> You know how they have that section when you first walk in and they have little deals and stuff over there? But it's so cute. So I look forward to using those. But yeah, now I'm about to bust down at least one of these bathrooms and then eat some dinner. Y'all, I finally showered, exfoliated, did my skincare. I'm feeling so accomplished and renewed. I ain't gonna hold you. I'm gonna keep it buck with you. I was definitely thinking about just showering tomorrow, but can't get into freshly clean sheets and your body dirty. <laughs> so I have a few more things on my list. I'm determined to get done today, um, which is just making sure I get my list together for the store tomorrow so we can be on task. And yeah, see y'all tomorrow after I get ready for church. Y'all, let me turn down the AC. Church today? Was so good. Um, I'm sorry, y'all know I be crying. <laughs> if, if you've been struggling lately, if you've been having suicidal thoughts, if you've been feeling unworthy, if you've been struggling to try to conceptualize and understand how much God really loves you, I highly encourage you to check out the three-part series. Um, the Elevation has done recently. The first one is called, um, what's the first one called? The God of, um, Lord, I cannot think of the name. The God of Already, The God of Again. Um, and it's another one. I can't remember the first one. I'll have them linked down in the description box. But like, y'all, I'm so blessed. <laughs> I'm so blessed. I'm so happy. I just feel really overwhelmed because it's, y'all, I don't even know how to put into words what it's like to really be living in your answered prayers. I'm gonna get myself together <laughs> while I pick up my target order. Um, then we're gonna run into home sense and then run some more errands. <laughs> Of course, all the art that I like is like $300. <laughs> about to show y'all this picture. I really, really like this hanging up. Only thing is I don't like the frame, but it's $250. And I see some other ones, but they just look sad. Okay, so my sister has given me the green light on this big painting, and it's huge. I think it would take up enough space on the wall to put up those two other um, black structures that I had spray painted a long, long time ago. <laughs> It'll be easy to hang up on the wall. So we're gonna take it home and see what it looks like.
Okay, y'all. The art is secured. I just went in and out of Kohl's to drop off my Amazon returns. And y'all, we did what needed to be done. I thought we were going to have to go to several home stores, but we only went to one. Got my Target order. We took back the Amazon stuff. I took the box to the trash this morning. So now we just need some food. And that's the wrap for this vlog, y'all. Um, I'm super excited about next week because we're going to the Snoop concert. We're going to see Beyonce. <laughs> and I have some activities planned for next weekend. So thanks for rocking with me through this slow, at-home, chill vlog. And I'll catch y'all on another one. Bye.